in for round one. We've got ourselves our planes and a forest and nothing to do with those cards. So we have to mull that hand, unfortunately. Uh, we get Nahiri uh, with two mountains and a Howl Pack Wolf. I think we might keep this just to get Howl Pack down, but yeah, we might be in trouble here. Let's keep it. Uh, warped Landscape. Sure, that can go on top because we can get our planes before too long. We are definitely going to be a little bit slow this game. Red on the other side as well. Well, I've got red too. We'll really kind of have to see if I play my Howl Pack or if I go and get my planes. I think it depends entirely on what he plays. Scourge Wolf. Oh, that's a little bit gross. That could be some trouble. Hey, forest. Cool. Um, let's put down a mountain. So, I could play Howl Pack Wolf, which will not be able to block. Or I could play Warped Landscape, go and get my planes, and then have a turn four Nahiri. But turn four Nahiri cannot protect herself if he has another creature, which he does. But Howl Pack Wolf can't protect Nahiri. Uh, we're just in bad shape overall. And hey, look, it's the red green drafter at the table that was taking all of our stuff. Stancia Masquerade doesn't quite do it either. So I guess we drop drop the warped landscape. We get the planes. We can blow up the Scourge Wolf. And then Ember Eye just kills Nahiri. So we basically use Nahiri as a four mana assassinate. Pumping the wolf. Sure. Down to 15. Down to 12. Blarg. Kessig Forge Master. Alright. Let's go get our planes. Wow, okay. Um, yeah, Nahiri is the assassinate. Looks like he got all the stuff that we wanted for an aggressive deck. That's unfortunate. Kill the Scourge Wolf. Nahiri will then bite it from the Forge Master and will get smacked by the Ember Eye. We can then drop a Thornhide, which will start to hold the ground a little bit. Maybe. Thornhide into Devil's Playground. Ember Eye at me. Forge Master at Nahiri. Sounds good. Pump the Wolf. Pump the Wolf? Pump the Wolf. Uncaged Fury the Wolf. Do it. You know you want to. No, just another pump. Alright. We take five. Down to seven. Now here he's dead. He didn't cast a spell, so that flips. We top deck land. Drop a Thornhide Wolves so we can block and kill one of those things. I guess it trades with the Flameheart. Although, actually, we have to block the Ember Eye if he hits another mountain. And then we can Devil's Playground. In with the team. We must block the Ember Eye, and we just die if he has on Caged Fury. Gross game. Gross game. Show me the Fury. Rush. Rush Fury? Rush, rush. Good game. Get me out of this game. <laughs> oh, all right. So we are not the beat down in any way, shape, or form. Um, Moldgraf might actually be okay. 
Also, why on earth did that guy not take the Halopack resurgence? We got that so late. Weird. Anyways, uh, yeah, I think Moldgraf comes in. And I think Provisioner comes out. Just to try to give us a little bit of breathing room. Yeah, let's do that. Otherwise, I think this will be my first round one loss in a Shadows draft. I will play first. I don't like this hand, but I'll keep it because it's got removal. Oh. All right. Drop him out and pass the turn. Pass the turn. <clears throat> this was a weird draft, I gotta say. Very weird draft. Draw Nahiri. It's kind of cool, actually. Pass the turn. So I can Lightning Axe, Warp Landscape, Plains, Nahiri, and try to see what I can do off of that. No Scourge Wolf, but you've got yourself a Ember Eye Wolf. It's not the worst thing I've ever seen. Coming in... Do I want to kill it? Just like right now? Yeah, you know what? We need as many turns as we can. So I'm just going to kill it. Toss away a uh, forest. Warped landscape. And a fork in the road. Um, yeah, let's pass the turn. Three drop, what you got? Ulrich's Kindred, that's where that went. Let's get a planes. And let's not cast Nahiri next turn, because she will just die. I will cast a Solitary Hunter, though. That blocks a Kindred, minus a bunch of pump spells. What do you have for four? You're coming in. You do that. I will not block, because you have combat tricks. Are you just going to waste them? No, there we go. Hit me for three. What else you got? You have Dance with Devils. Gross. All of the gross. So, I mean, if I play Nahiri, she just dies, right? Blarg, but we need to kill that friggin' Ulrich's Kindred. Yeah, our deck is way too slow. Way too slow. So yeah, we either let the devils hit Nahiri, or we block a devil, and one devil hits Nahiri, and the dead and devil hits Nahiri. Yeah, Nahiri's dead, once again. And this is going to be a round one loss. Luckily it's Swiss draft, so we do get the full three rounds. Nahiri and Nahiri. Congratulations, Nahiri is dead. But we'll take a devil with us. Unless it friggin' rush of adrenaline, rush of adrenaline, which happened last game. <laughs> really? Wait, three. Are you gonna uncaged Fury yet? Spiteful motives. Nahiri doesn't die. Nahiri doesn't die. There is that. Oh, Nahiri dies. 
Blarg. I'm so sick and tired of red decks. <laughs> I got um, totally blown out by two red decks last night at FNM, including one that was a mono red deck that if I could just draw one of my five pieces of removal, the entire deck was dead because it was Ravenous Bloodseeker with Spiteful Motives and a Murderer's Axe and True Faith Sensor and just an absolute Voltron Ravenous Bloodseeker. One removal spell and the game was over for my opponent and I couldn't hit it. All right, we have no creatures left in our hand. And we're facing down a devil. Let the pinging begin. <clears throat> Gibbering Fiend, you got it. Three card types. One card left in his hand. None of this helps. Um, so we'll fork in the road to thin our library by a couple of lands. I will take a forest and throw away a forest. Yoink and yoink. I will play that for. Whoops! I'll play that forest. I will drop a Stency Masquerade and pass the turn. And then hope. Hit me for three, down to 11. Hey, wolves, they will hold the ground a little bit. Still don't quite know how we get back into this game, though. We don't have flyers. This is arguably my biggest thing. Hmm. No attacks, no plays. All right. Ravenous Bloodseeker. Seems fine. Hit you for four. Pass the turn. Four cards in hand. Is he flooding out? So we have one removal spell left. A uh, fiery temper. I think that's all we have left. Uh, duelist. Bloodseeker can't block. I assume. If he was smart, he would do Thornhide Wolves. Because he would think about the aim high. So he's got three cards in hand. Two cards in hand. Three lands. I dislike that. In, in, and in. We will go aim high on the wolves. We will block the duelist. Kill the duelist. He's f 6 I think. He has. Alright, our Bloodseeker is going to get a counter. So that's nifty. Unless he has an aim high, which he might. In for one. In for one? In for one! Get a counter. He's a bit bigger. And then pass the turn. Well, we're surprisingly not dead yet. Uh, okay. Why did you not take the second Howl Pack Resurgence? It was so late in that pack. There's almost nothing that would have been better for him than to take that second Howl Pack. So weird. Alright, two cards in hand. In with the Bloodseeker. <clears throat> Blocks with the devil. Ping me for one. Mm. 
You got Quilled Wolfy Wolf. Green, one, two, three, four. Probably not worth playing that land. Keep it for the Bloodseeker. So we could make Bloodseeker a four, two. Not the worst. Forge Master, three, two, trample. Pretty good. Two cards still in hand. Have a feeling they're lands. Just like these lands. We will. We're at seven. We'll continue playing it safe. Come in with the Bloodseeker. Get in for two. Get a counter. Um, pass the turn, keeping up mana for the Quilled Wolf. That becomes a 4 3. Still fine. <clears throat> so we can now make this a 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. We can make it a 7 1. 7 1 first strike. No attacks. Cool. Good <laughs> jeez. Uh, continue to play it safe. In with the Bloodseeker. Fiery Temper would be so good right now. Is this blocks or becomes blocked? Blocks or becomes blocked. Um, no effects. I will discard a land. Make it a 5-3. Um... So, I mean, if he has the temper, it's dead anyway, so let's discard another one. Let's get in for seven. Got there. Down to six. We've got ourselves a four six. That can become an eight two. Pyre Hound. Not a wolf, thankfully. It's a hound. Killer. All right, we will come in with the Bloodseeker. Well, it has to block now. Blocks with that. Just the chump. Sounds good. Drop a convicted killer. Pass the turn. I thought we were toast. Thornhide Wolves for the victory. Wow. All right. How do we recreate that win? So he does have Howl Pack, but I don't think Root Out is correct to put in. Rush probably won't save anything. No, I think we just go back in. And hope he doesn't get the things to do the things. All right, game three, we've got uh, two lands, which isn't great, but we do have a scavenger. We do have a bloodseeker. We're a land away from a Stentia Masquerade. I will keep it. Mountain, sounds good. Uh, solitary Hunter, not a land. I would like to see a land on the top. And not an Ember Eye Wolf hitting me in the face. Maybe he just tapped two mana for fun. Forge Master, alright. Uh, Pack Guardian, you're also not a land. So we'll go with the Scavenger. Just the solid block. Nahiri we probably won't see for a very long time. Mono red. Swinging in. So you got a trick. So I'm not going to throw away the scavenger this turn. Take the two. Flip the forge master. Please be a land. Thank you. Um, Bloodseeker or Masquerade? Masquerade doesn't do much for me. So I think Bloodseeker's the play. 
Yeah, Bloodseeker. I would love to see a planes on top, but I don't think that's going to be a thing that happens. <clears throat> Solidly on the mono red. I will take three. Planes on top would be nice. Um, fiery Temper on top would be nice. Lightning Axe. Passing the turn. Must have a lot of green stranded in his hand. Gloom Widow doesn't quite get me there. Um, so I could Stency a Masquerade and make the Bloodseeker a little bit bigger. Actually, I could make the Bloodseeker a lot bigger because I could discard the Masquerade, Madnessing it out. Yeah, let's do that. In for one. What? Dance with devils. That's gross. Why are you so gross? So, block, block. Dead Bloodseeker. Block, block, dead blood seeker. So I think we discard the masquerade anyway so that we can kill both devils. Alright, so both devils are dead, so we're going to get pinged for one. And then we really need to land for that hunter. Ping me for one, ping the Bloodseeker for one. There goes that dream. No land, in for three. Um, I'll take the three. Or do I just get uncaged rushed? What would that be? That would be rush, so that'd be five, six. I don't know, just in for five. Alright. Pass the turn. Blarg! <laughs> Gloom Widow, down you go. You can't block, so we have to block the Flame Heart with the Scavenger. Um. Solidly mono red. If I get beat by mono red twice in two days, I'm not gonna be happy. Um, malevolent whispers. All right, so I block the gloom widow. I take three. Scavenger eats it. You have another rush? Just for funsies? Need that planes on top. Hello. One land on top. You can't have that many choices. All right, let's pause the game while our opponent mulls through their probably massive amounts of choices. There we go. Looks like they've chosen to do nothing. We get hit for three. We're down to six. Goodbye, scavenger. Pass the turn. Land. Ho. Solitary hunter? Yeah, solitary hunter. So we can block and kill the werewolf. Can't block with the gloom widow, so it just needs to go through. This doesn't investigate or anything. Oh, it's madness. That's what it can do. In for three. Down to 17. <clears throat> Am I dead? In 
in for three. All right, we block, because we have to. We do not have a choice. Deal two to it. And then if he rushes, what happens? Five, two of it gets eaten by the hunter. Three of it comes through, I go to three. But at least the Flameheart Werewolf dies. Rush, all right. Uncaged Fury. Ooh, no, we get the Werewolf off the field. Fiery Temper to the face. No Fiery Temper to the face. Gibbering Fiend to the face. Mountain. And for three. Time for the all-star Thornhide Wolves. <clears throat> Gatstaff Arsonists. Not good. Not good. Blood Mad Vampire. Or Intrepid Provisioner. Um... I guess Blood Mad. Yeah, let's go with Blood Mad. Pass the turn. Hmm. We're going to try to hold on. I wonder if he really went into mono red or if he's really just hurting for green that bad. Inner struggle. Okay. Dual shot. Oh. Good game. Good game. Get me out of here. That is two nights in a row that I have been murdered by mono red in this format. It doesn't feel good. Uh, that's unfortunately my very first Shadows Over Innistrad round one lost. This is uh, draft number seven on Magic Online uh, with four or five drafts in paper as well. And that's the first time I've lost in round one. Very unfortunate. Hopefully we can win those back with uh, rounds two and rounds three. And I'll see you for then, uh, where hopefully we don't face such a disgusting deck. But I'll see you then.